What's up everybody, my name is Ernesto Medina and today I'm here to give you a tour of the architecture school. I've posted a few videos and a lot of people were commenting and saying like we want more videos about architecture. So I'm just going to try to show you as much as I can so you guys get a better idea of what it is like to be an architecture student. And as I'm talking to you, finally, your triplets are getting here. I don't know if you can, if you can see them. Why do you guys take so long? Why do you guys take so long? Why do you take so long? This is my friend Ligia, she's Brazilian. We met through our fraternity. We both pledged for the architecture fraternity Alpha Rokai. So this is Mateo, he's also Brazilian. Man. I swear all my friends are not Brazilian, but these are the two that are here right now. They just started our YouTube channel now about like the life of an architecture student and they've been making really funny videos. They, they just posted a video about what it is like to pull an own idea. I can tell you, I cannot tell you what that is like because I've never pulled an own idea. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Can you believe that? What? No way. I've in architecture, I've never pulled an online. I made it my mission to graduate, and my cap is gonna say I did not pull an online. They're here, as promised. Hey, this vlog is in English. No, no. Switch, 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 switch. Right now. I'm Valentina, I'm Lorena, and I'm Carol, and we're the triplets. They never like to speak English. I literally force them all the time. They refuse to speak English. But like, today I'm gonna do it for you. Just for just you. for you guys. So we're gonna try to show you as much as we can around the school and we wanna give you like um, an idea of what it is like to be an architecture student, the struggles that we go through. Um, just so, not, not so you guys get discouraged because I want you to go to architecture school. <laughs> I, I love architecture school, but Me too. we want you to know what it really is like. And if you don't like it, you can always go go to the market. <laughs> Let's go guys. Let's show them around studio. This is the second floor. Can I tell me guys what this is second floor is for? Second floor is for third years Third and, and fourth, fourth year. Yeah. And then and fifth year goes up Usually. There's Yeah. Usually landscape goes all the way to the wall. And, and interiors. They always put a lot of plants because landscape students. Isn't this your model for your class? Yes. Can you show us? This is our site model for our final project. For the Japan project. For the Japan project. And the funny part is that they didn't even use like a cheap material. They used freaking plexi, which is like glass. But it was for free. Like acrylic. Gives, gives to what? It. it was for free. It was for free? Oh, they didn't pay for it. The school paid for it. That's yeah. why they did it. Yeah. Anyways, guys, like I just showed you studio. Now we're going to go show you the rest of pretty much the university. We want to take you to like the business school where Carlo all goes to school most of the time. We want to show you the library and like just pretty much around campus. So let's go with this. So this is a school of architecture guys. Can you guys shut up? Shut up. These are the famous tiles that we love so much. So right now they're putting new tiles. Those are the perks of living in Florida. We get hurricanes that come and destroy our school. This is the other side of the architecture building. That's where the professors are usually working all the time. We only go there when we need to talk to them and when we need to talk to an advisor. Look at you walking around the school. Kato, where are we going? We're going to the business school. Woo! <laughs> that was so fake. <laughs> the business school was designed by one of my old professors for, from my college. Yeah, before, Miami -Dade yeah before they came to FIU, they were doing architecture at Miami Dade. In this building, which is Ryder Business, I had my personal selling classes. That's the main entrance of FIU, or like the main entrance through A Street. And that's the first building that you encounter. If you bring food, the only place you have to heat it up is in this building. That's not true. We have it no, in the architecture but school no, too. No es de la universidad. Oh, okay. I mean, you can also go to the library and stuff. I guess in this area, yeah. So yeah, if, if you guys want to heat up some food, you have to go to the Ryder building. That, that one is called CBC, and in the first floor of CBC, we have the auditoriums, and in the second floor, we have regular classrooms. And this is Mango Guy. This is also where we come to eat a lot. I have taken classes in the in the first floor. Uh -huh. From this side we have classrooms and this side is advice. So yeah guys, this is Panda Express. And that's the Starbucks over there. What did you say? I said I'm gonna go to Starbucks. Of course I knew you were gonna go to Starbucks. That's literally what you do for a living. She spends so much money in Starbucks guys. I'm a gold member. She's a gold she's a gold member, like that's how you know how much money she spends. I think she walks in, she doesn't even have to do the line. Look at her. <laughs> Adri convinced me because I'm really easy to convince. Thank you. Adri, why are you so cheap? Why are you getting free cups of water? Because I'm a student. Why are you complaining about? I'm not complaining. It's just I asked for a cup of water and she asked if I wanted the free one. Of course I wanted the free one. If not, I would have given her a water bottle. 
Thank you. I don't want to show you guys like one of her big auditoriums that hopefully there's not a class going on. Show us. This is what she was talking about guys. There were two people inside. But anyways. Do you like the school though? Do you enjoy this, the business? Yeah, I like it. What have you learned? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Guys, this you is the main it. like yeah. courier of the business school. That's the big sign that says this is a business school. So, how many classes have you had? Uh, four. I don't have like the best like memories of this building <laughs> because the only class I had here was the math class, and like I hated it. I took my first auditorium class in here, and it was the worst class, the worst experience ever. Oh yeah, I hate lectures too. But because I don't like big classes, I prefer small. Mm -hmm. small but anyways, like the FIU Business School is actually really good. It's rated like one of the best in the country, actually. Mm -hmm. So if that's something that you guys are interested, definitely check out the school because it's really affordable and you know it's good. Yeah. And we're not getting paid to promote no. it, so it's just like our honest opinion. But if you want to pay us with FIU. Mer merch or something, at least some FIU shirts or something. Oh, <laughs> um, this guy is the biggest auditorium that we have in at the university. It's called SIPA and it's really cool. It has like a green roof. So I'm, I, I want to show you guys with the throne what it looks like from the top. That's why I was saying it looked like a toilet. It's kind of cool, I'm not gonna lie. And it has like that green roof that makes it even better. What's up, guys? Look at the turtle, guys. Turtle. This turtle. Let the, let the police go through. So, guys, this is GC. This is the main hall of the school. There you can see all the fraternity banners and all the organizations. That's also where all the food is like. Right now we're going to Pollo Tropical. Well, I don't know if they're going to Pollo Tropical, but I'm going to Pollo Tropical. And yeah, this is FIU. Like I said, there is a bunch of tours going on. That's usually where all the people that are doing tabling for organization and nonprofits, they stand right here. So yeah, the babies are a little bit more special. What are you guys getting? And because we live in Florida, this is what happened. You go inside five minutes to eat. And now it's about to start raining. So this is what walk on water happens every year. The School of Architecture hosts walk on water. Second year students have to like basically design shoes that are gonna help them to like cross the whole thing. If you don't cross, you don't pass the class. And the pe person that wins gets like $2,000 and guess who won last time? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you have videos of it? We can probably make a whole video just about walk on water uh -huh, and ask, see? maybe interviewing Professor Cannabis and Adri, the and Adri. So let us know if you guys would like to see a video about walk on water. Okay. Guys, so we're heading back to the architecture school, back from the library that we just went to eat. And now we're going to do the tour of the fabrication lab that I'm going to show you right now. That's where we make everything that has to do with wood. Hey, Julia, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm making a video. Is it okay if I come in here? Yeah. Okay. So guys, this is Julia. She's like the manager. <laughs> you don't like videos? <laughs> She's the manager of the woodshop. She's amazing. She always helps us with everything we have to do. She's literally a genius with everything that has to do with wood. She used to be a student at the architecture school, but she graduated a few years ago. What's up, bro? Hey, how you doing? What are you doing? I'm doing good. What are you cutting? Uh, making a chair. So guys, this is, I just posted a video, a picture like yesterday, okay. right here in this position doing that thing that he's doing right now. <laughs> so this is how it happened. Be Different careful, things. don't look right into the weld. Oh, he's built. Oh, yeah. shit. He's welding right now, so I shouldn't be standing over there. We have somebody building a model over here. What are you building? It's the base for my chair. She's building a chair, guys. <laughs> like you see, everything happens here. 
There's a lot of furniture building going on. So guys, this is a tour of the whole school that I, I promised you. I hope you guys like it. If you want me to do more videos like this about the architecture life and the architecture student life, let me know in the comments below. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see the videos coming up. And if you haven't seen my video about Japan, go ahead right now and watch it. It's really fun so you guys get an idea what it is like to go to Japan as an architecture student and experience the culture. Thank you so much for watching my first video and thank you. Feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing.